Hello and welcome everyone to Tech Weekly, your weekly dose of news relating to tech, data science and AI from Bode Infinity. Is your two kidneys safe? Hai? If yes, then keep them safe, as Apple is reportedly planning to launch iPhone and Apple Watch on its event on September 7. According to Mark Gurman, the non-pro iPhone 14 lineup will have a 5.4-inch mini display and a 6.1-inch standard display. These phones will also continue to have the current A15 Bionic chip and they will look extremely similar to iPhone 13. The iPhone 14 Pro will be reportedly be more exciting, replacing the current camera version with a pinhole setup, hence it will be smaller. Adam Newman, the co-founder and former CEO of the shared co-working space WeWork, is working on a new rental real estate business that has received funding from Anderson Howards. According to a report from the New York Times, the venture capital firm has invested around $350 million in Newman's up-and-coming real estate business called Flow, where it aims to Flow aims to uh, provide a consistent housing experience across a chain of branded apartment complexes. Kya work from home ne aapka work life balance hila diya hai? Well, adding some salt to your burn, Windows users of WhatsApp can now enjoy the application without using their phone or even having their phone available. The company has released new app that is available on Windows Store. Are your fingers not tired enough from scrolling reels, shorts? Well, Amazon is the next company in the line to generate engagement in form of TikTok-like social feed. According to Watchful, an AI intelligence platform, Amazon is testing vertical photo and video feed for its new app. Amazon TikTok clone does not come totally out of the blue, as on TikTok, Amazon product recommendation is extremely popular. The hashtag Amazon Finds has around 25.6 billion views on it. Google has started the rollout of Android 13, starting with Pixel phones. The new feature includes the ability to customize non-Google app icons to match your home screen wallpaper that we saw in Android 13's developer preview, in the new permission to cut down notifications and spams, and a new option to limit which of your photos and videos a app can particularly access. That's it for this week guys, see you guys in the next one. Until then, keep learning, keep accelerating, and as always, make sure to smash the like button and hit the subscribe button.